I'm just going to demonstrate the rules of nine ball, which is such a wonderful game. You have nine balls, and you have to hit them in order, from one through nine. The eight ball, you'll recognize it's black. It comes from the normal pool set. You can play it with normal pool balls. Um, and the only way the win that you win the game is by sinking the nine ball, which is here, which is this yellow one with a bigger spot on it. It's this, actually the first of the striped balls. So the nine ball is the one that you need to sink. And starting with this other yellow one, which is the one ball. Now, as long as you hit the balls, the, cor the correct next ball along in the pecking order, that single hit. So we must hit this one ball first. Can't hit that. Can't hit the nine ball. But if I knock the nine ball in, I'll win the game instantly. And if I knock any other ball in, um, I get my, my go will continue. If I knock the white ball in, it's scratch, and my opponent can place it anywhere they like on the table and hit it in any direction. So try not to sink the white ball. So I'm on the one ball here. Shows you now. I think the next one is blue, blue or red. Oh, it's blue. So we're still okay. We're knocking the blue ball. I don't have to knock the blue ball in. I can knock any colour ball in with the blue ball, or as a result of hitting the blue ball. Now we've got the red ball here. Hit it really hard in the ho and this is the thing with nine ball. It's actually a good idea to hit the balls really, really hard and let them go over. As long as something goes in, your turn will continue. You just do things like that, just crazy. Oh look, it went in. It did actually go in. Four cushion shot. That was just luck there. You do get such things as lucky players and unlucky players in all games, don't you? See, if this was lined up better, I could probably knock that nine ball in with it, but... Um, it's far too difficult to shot from here. So we're just going to go for that. Oh, it looks like I failed again. <laughs> okay, so now my opponent's turn to hit that green ball. Which is number six, I think. And now they've got to hit the brown one, which is the number seven. Now they have to hit the eight ball, which is the number eight. Oh, nearly scratched there. Now that would actually be very difficult queuing that. And is it going to be scratched now? Oh, my word. That's crazy luck. Uh, they missed the nine ball. After such incredible luck. So how do we win nine ball? By potting the nine ball. So I'll show you one more time, just in case the game might take a different turn. Um, don't need to see this. Spend enough time doing this myself. Right, um, let's have another game. Um, it's still my, my turn to break. I'm just going to put some forward English on the ball. Gonna hit them really hard. And if something goes in, a numbered ball goes in, my turn continues. If the nine ball goes in on the break, which has happened to me, then that's just an instant win. I think the nine ball, where it is in the pack, it tends to be unusual for it to go in. It's either right in the middle of the pack or at the back. I can't quite remember. So it's hitting them in order here. Into the purple. Orange. Now green. That brown could be tricky. Snooping himself on the brown. Got to hit that ball. But eagle and I get and I get to place my cue ball anywhere. It's it's actually just like a scratch. If you hit the wrong ball, if you think results in a scratch. Results in your opponent being able to. Just ball anywhere on the table and hit it. And nine times out of ten, there is somewhere to place it where you can knock in the nine ball very easily. So, 
we're just going to put some reverse on that so it curves around a bit oh dear oh but i ooh. don't know don't know jack might not have this in the bag yes he does that's jack He's just being kind, so let's start again and we'll do a third game. Yeah, so you'll understand the concept of scratch, which is just that a foul in pool results in your opponent placing the ball anywhere on the table and having a free shot. In normal pool, I think you can hit any ball, but I think in nine ball, you still have to be hitting the next ball in order. Now, did you notice that he hit the blue one in with the yellow, even though the blue one wasn't due to be pot? To be hit, to put their energy to be hit. So again, he hits the red one and pots it. And now he's on the purple. And he hits it, collides with the nine ball, sets the nine ball up very nicely there for potentially being potted at some point. And now he's on the orange, which is in a difficult position there to pot without going into the middle. And that's why he missed it. So now I can go for the orange. Try perhaps to bounce onto the nine ball afterwards. Oh, and in it goes. And that's what I was just about to say, is that there is an incentive for hitting the balls hard. For just whacking the balls, because if you just whack like that, and you accidentally knock in the nine ball, well, you win the game. That's nine ball.